Uh, Daniel Perez taking the stand in his own defense today. He is the leader of a local commune that lived off the life insurance payouts of its dead members. He is accused of killing a woman and having sex with minors. New at six, Cakes Lily Wu joins us live from downtown Wichita tracking what Perez said on the stand. Lily. Well, Susan, a large majority of today's proceedings included hearing from the man, Daniel Perez, but we also learned that he started using the name Lou Castro after he claims he was beaten and then forgot his identity. For the first time since the trial began, the 55 year old took the stand and addressed the charges against him. Daniel Perez is charged with first degree murder in connection to the 2003 drowning death of Patricia Hughes. Prosecutors believe Perez manipulated women to take out large life insurance policies, then lived off the proceeds when they died. Did you in any way plan to murder Patricia Hughes? No. Did you in any way kill Patricia Hughes? No. Was that an accident? Yes. Were you even there when it happened? No. Did you in any way force sex? On Emily when she was underage? No. Anyway, force sex on Emily at any time by no. force or fear or threat? No. Perez is also accused of child sex crimes with young girls while at a ranch compound north of Kichai. State witnesses have testified against Perez, saying he sexually abused them and told them he could see into the future and even bend time. Again, Perez denied those allegations. Did you tell Emily? It was Trisha's time to die a week before June 26th of 2003. No. So that she had to help you because you couldn't be too close when someone passed over to the other side. No. Because you could get sucked in because you were an angel, right? No. Now the jury will return after the long holiday weekend. They're expected back on Tuesday to hear instructions and then begin deliberations. Reporting live in downtown Wichita, Lily Wu, Cake News.